POC Network here at CES 2018. I'm standing next to Rob here with HDMI Licensing. He's the CEO of HDMI Licensing. Uh, here to talk to us about HDMI 2.0 specification. Yes. So what's new about 2.0? That what, what gives us the advantage over 2.0? or excuse me, 2.1 over 2.0. That's correct, so we're, we're now at HDMI 2.1. Uh, it was, uh, the specification was released in November, and so now there's a bunch of very exciting, interesting new features. Okay, what are we looking uh, so at? So today here, we are showing off the, ex the ultra high bandwidth. So HDMI 2 was 18 gigabits, and we're now at 48 gigabits, so an extreme jump in bandwidth. That is. That will get us to 8K, 60 uncompressed. Okay. And with uh, DSC compression, uh, it's a three to one visually lossless compression, that'll get us to 10K, 60. Oh, very nice. So 60P, a 10K compressed, and um, uncompressed for 8K. Uh, exactly. Very nice. And so uh, uh, we'll be seeing products uh, work our way up there. There's some 8K here at CES, but we're also seeing 4K 120. So yes. I think 4K 120 will start to make its way very quickly into the marketplace uh, as 8K continues to mature. Okay, and as for products that are, because this is just now, you said November, correct? In yes. terms of this actually being announced and released, uh, how soon do you really expect to see products starting to roll into the market from familiar brands like Pioneer and Yamaha? And so there's uh, additional features, uh, such as uh, your viewers may be familiar with audio return channel, which oh, allows yes. you to bring audio back from the TV over the HDMI cable in the reverse direction to an AVR or to a soundbar. Now with the 2.1, we have what's called enhanced audio return channel. And what that is, is we can, the ARC was things like Dolby Digital, DTS, Stereo. Now we can get up to Dolby Atmos, DTSX, all the advanced object audio, high bitrate audio. And so that's one of the features that will be rolled out quickly. Okay. So those products you mentioned there, uh, they're ready to go. They're waiting for the compliance test specification, in which case they can certify their product, turn that feature on, and consumers will have that in their hands fairly soon. Perfect, so we're really talking about, uh, for a lot of these products, just a firmware update that's coming out soon. Exactly, and so things like dynamic HDR as well could just be a firmware upgrade for some products. Perfect, okay, so we might see it within the weeks, months, who knows, once that, that gets rolled out, and uh, something to look forward to for both current products on the market and this year. Exactly. Well, perfect. Thank you so much for uh, taking the time with us uh, to talk about it. And uh, we look forward to uh, seeing where it goes from here. All right. Look for HDMI 2.1 products on your shelf soon. You got it. I want 10K. <laughs> <laughs> we all do. If you want to stay on top of all the latest and greatest and or at least the gadgets we cover, remember to subscribe right here. Subscription button. Click it. You're going to want to. There's lots of videos, interviews, previews, all sorts of stuff. Button. Click it.